What's going on everyone? Your boy Kevin back again with another video for you guys. I hope everyone's doing good and thank you for being here. Today I got another phone from Vivo for you guys. A lot of you guys asked me to do a review on this phone. This phone is called Vivo IQ Neo 5. This is like the new release phone from Vivo. And this is not a flagship phone, it's like a mid-range close to flagship phone. And the cost of this phone is around like $400. For $400 guys, you get a lot of phone here. Like when I mean a lot of phone, you get a lot of phone. You get a 66 fast supercharge that can charge this phone from zero to 100 in 30 minutes. That is insane. You got a huge display, 6.6 .6 inch AMOLED display. You got 120 Hertz refresh here. You got Snapdragon 870, all that for only $400 guys. Isn't that insane? What we're gonna do today, we're gonna be doing the unboxing of this phone. I'm gonna take pictures with it. We're gonna do a gaming test. We're gonna do a display test. We're gonna do sound test. I'm gonna do every kind of test you can throw at this phone. We're even gonna do a Geekbench on it. We're gonna see the scores on it. But before we do that, make sure you smash that subscribe button. There's a little bell right in the corner. Make sure you press that so every time I make a new video, you're gonna get a reminder. So let's start this video. This video is brought to you by Stone Master. That's how the box looks like. You get a SIM key and manual books. You get a cheap silicone case. You get cables. And you get a 66 watt supercharged. They can charge the phone from 100% in 30 minutes. And it's really heavy. I really like the design of this. You got beautiful triple camera set up with the 48 megapixel main camera. Very nice design, and you got beautiful color. Look at this, guys. It's like sky blue, baby blue, very nice color. And you got a little bit of curve in the back, and you get all plastic frame all around, but it looks like it's actually aluminum. You got your on and off button right there, and you got your volume rockers right there. You got your front selfie camera right there, and you get a 6.6 .6 inch AMOLED display flat. Do not get a headphone jack. Very nice design and it's really, really light. And this phone has a 4,500 milliamp battery. Now let's try the case. Actually, the case, when you put it on, it actually does protect the phone. If you guys can see, the whole camera is covered. And the front display, each corner, it is covered. So if you drop it, you are good. You move it around, you're good, even the back. Before we get into this video, guys, let's go through the specs of this phone. 6.6 inch AMOLED display, 120 Hertz, HDR 10, 1080 times 2400 pixels, Android 11, original OS for IQ, Snapdragon 870, Adreno 650, camera for the rear, you got 48 MP wide, you got 13 MP ultra wide, you got 2 MP depth, and the phone can record 4K 30 60. Selfie camera, you got 16 MP wide, can record 1080p 30. Battery got 4,400 milliamp. You got fast charge of 66 watt. And you got on display fingerprint scanner and face unlock. For color, black, blue, orange. The phone comes with NFC, but the NFC does not work with Google Pay. And you get an on display fingerprint scanner in this phone and face unlock. Let's try them both. Now we're gonna try the face unlock. One thing I wanted to mention guys, this phone, the good thing about it is you're not gonna get no fingerprints on it. So if you decide you don't wanna put a case on to just show off your phone, the good thing about it is no fingerprints. That's what I like about it. And you got a really shiny color as well too. If you guys can see, this phone has 120 Hz refresh rate. So you can put it at 60 or you can put a smart switch. But remember, 120 Hz refresh rate is going to waste more battery. So let's see the 120. That's 120. It's quick. Look at this. So fast. And if you want to put it at 60, 
I think it's still gonna be pretty good. That's 60. So right out of the box, guys, this phone does not come with Google Play Store. You have to download it. It's very easy. You go to uh, the App Store. First, you download uh, Google Chrome. Google Play Store comes on. Very easy. This phone comes with a lot of Chinese app right out of the box. Make sure you delete most of them because you are not going to use them. And uh, you're going to save a lot of memory. Let me on show you guys phone. a little bit the phone setting on this phone. So if you go to the side here, that's where your notifications. And if you go to your right, that's where quick settings is. So pretty much you get your quick settings like your Wi-Fi, your airplane mode, your uh, volume, your brightness, Bluetooth, and uh, your flashlight, screenshot, and etc. Let's go main settings. You got your airplane mode. You got your mobile. You got your other networks and connections. It's Remember guys, this phone, it is not global version. So the NFC on this phone, it is not going to work with Google Pay. You got your OTG, notification and status bar. So you can go here and customize it. You got your uh, display. One thing about this guys, you come all the way down first. You go to screen colors, put it on bright. So you get brighter colors. Then you come down to uh, ultra HD. Make sure you turn that on because it's off. Then you got your refresh rate right there. And that's for that. Sounds. System navigation, fingerprint and face unlock, ultra gaming mode, your system management. Let's go here. Languages, let's go here. Let's see what kind of languages. So actually, this phone has a lot of languages, guys. Look at this. You got applications and about. And that's pretty much it, guys, for the settings. So this phone responds really fast, guys. If you want to open something, it is quick. Look at this. I downloaded Google Voice. Let's see how quick does it respond. Open camera. Opening app. That was fast. Open Facebook. Set alarm for 8.30 a.m. Okay, 8.30 a.m. Setting your alarm. Honestly, guys, I really want to know the Geekbench score on this phone. And obviously, you guys want to know too. So let's go check out the scores. So we got single score, 1,027. Multi-score, 3,450. You have a big display, 6.6 .6 inch AMOLED display. Obviously you got a huge display on this phone. And usually Vivo phones, when they have AMOLED display, they have really nice display and their phones get really bright. Let's go watch a video on this phone so you guys can see the display and how bright it gets and how loud the speakers are. Honestly, holding this phone in my hand, if I really want to play games on this phone, honestly, the back camera does not bother me and the phone is very light. That's what I like about it. And you have 120 Hz refresh rate in this phone and you're running Snapdragon 870. So pretty much you can throw anything at this phone, can handle it. So pretty much throw any game at it, you should be good. Let's go download a game and do a gaming test on this phone. First, let's see how quick this phone downloads. I have the fastest internet, I have a 5G internet. And this game is 138 megabytes. Let's see how quick it's going to download it. See guys, 138 megabytes. And we're running Snapdragon 870. Very quick.
That's 120 hertz, guys. Personally, myself, I really like the setup of the camera on this phone. You got a triple camera setup in the back, and he has a 48 MP camera. And usually, Vivo phones take beautiful pictures. Let's go look at the camera settings on this phone so you guys can see better how the camera setting is. Then, I'm gonna take some pictures, some videos for you guys so you guys can see the pictures and videos this phone takes. So, for camera, you get a lot of features here, guys. So, you got your night, you got your portrait, so you got your beauty. The beauty on this phone does a really good job. You got your bouquet. You got your styles, HDR, and you got your AI. Let's go to photo. For photo, make sure you guys always have your AI on. You got your ultra wide, one time, two time. See how many zoom this phone has, 10 times zoom. You got your video, video stabilizer. You got your standard stabilizer, and you got your ultra stabilizer. And the same thing, you get your ultra, one time, two time. And you got your face beauty for video and your filters. Let's go see what's max you can record in this phone. So Max, you got 4K60 on this phone. Then you got your fun videos for more. You got your 48 MP, Panorama, live photo, slow motion, time lapse. You got your Joby Vision. You got your DOC, Pro Sport, Do Experience. Let's see if you can take a bunch of pictures at the same time with no delay. Okay. You got a delay between, guys. Let's hold it. Wow. You can take 20 pictures in a less than a second, guys, if you hold it. That's crazy. Now let's go look at some pictures and videos that I took with this phone. Honestly guys, for $400, I'm not kidding you guys, you get a lot of phone here. Like what else you need out of a phone? Like honestly, what, you, what else you need? You got 66 supercharge that can charge the phone from uh, 100% in 30 minutes. That is insane. You got 100 hertz refresh rate. Perfect for gaming and smooth. You got Snapdragon 870. That's 
honestly, you can't even tell the difference from Snapdragon 870 and Snapdragon 888. I cannot even tell the difference. You got a huge display AMOLED that you're gonna enjoy watching videos on or playing games on, and the speakers get really loud. And you got 4,500 million battery that's gonna almost last you a whole day. Honestly, what else you need out of a phone that only costs $400 that take beautiful pictures? I'm just speechless. You guys let me know in the comments what do you guys think. And I'm gonna catch you guys on my next video. Peace out for now.